thank you so 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 much um again uh, our job is to try and then leave it to fate okay so i want to f- you to first tell me what you've been doing for the past 50 days ever since the lockdown and then we'll talk about your journey from mumbai to la but first tell me what you've been doing with your time well 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 um so so initially it was difficult um because in the first first couple of weeks you know i was just uh wondering what you know what has hit the world and yes. uh, i i didn't know i was just binge watching shows from like from like uh, 11 in the morning till 11 in the night and nothing else to do because like you know you're figuring out um yes how are you going to use this time and um, yeah. you know what are you going to do to make it productive uh, yes. so uh, after the first week my eyes were like i thought they'll come out <laughs> because i was watching <laughs> so much of tv and you yeah. know laptop and phone yeah. and this and that um and then i just got mentally fatigued so i yeah. thought this can't go on for you know maybe two months three months this can't happen um so so yeah then i kind of figured out you know what to do about it productively yes. uh, do a little bit of dance um uh cook make cooking videos <laughs> um i i'm also writing something so that took up time uh, just exercising we have a park uh, which is close by and you're you're allowed to bike and exercise and stuff so that okay. happened um and yeah just just constructive basically trying to be a little constructive about uh, this this thing you know um and yeah just uh, connecting with my parents they're back home they're like 10 minutes away from you <laughs> like, oh they they uh, they're not with you at the moment no they're no, not they're there not, with you they're not okay. no in fact dad is an essential worker in mumbai and okay. he's been working since day one so okay. um uh he's into pharmacy so you know he's okay. been on his toes with the masks and the yes. medicines and the emergencies and this and that and uh yeah so my parents are very close to you and i make it a point to to talk to mom every day dad my grandmom um that's about it please thank your dad from all of us in mumbai for yeah. the effort for all his effort and seriously yeah. that's thank very you. very thank you yeah it, it's so it's it's so nerve wracking for me because yes. you know you like you uh, he's he's 60 up and um yeah. we know what's happening with you know that age group so it's it's yes. very uh, nerve wracking uh, on that front but hopefully yeah. things will be fine and yeah he's he's doing great uh, now at this point all my other family members are like how is he allowed to work even we want to get out of the house you know, because it's <laughs> it's going it's yeah. like it's going to continue and you know it's yeah. people are going insane with uh, like sitting yes. at home for such Absolutely. a long time and maybe maybe yeah. moving so crazy too. yes yes so crazy is the world yeah yeah so yeah. you do do you have like a constructed day like it's is it like a fixed day or is it like flexible no. and you just go well, with the, the flow is, with me i get bored very easily so i have okay. a list of like eight to nine things and i keep on like juggling and mixing and matching do you know this is one of the best ways to get there's something called quarantine fatigue at the moment and one of the best ways to deal with it is to juggle things around change your environment change what you're doing just to step it up for yourself so yeah. wow you're doing it naturally <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if it's a good thing or a bad thing but I yeah. I you know I get bored very easily but luckily uh you know out here at least things are getting better and stuff and you can you can now do a couple of more things than what what one could do like step out and you know meet okay. a friend or um I did a closed shoot yesterday uh with okay. a friend's help uh, we shot a, we're doing a short film uh giving tribute to Irfan and Rishi Kapoor um sahab. wow tell us yeah. about this tell us um, about this so it's it's a it's a it's a very well written uh wacky short film uh with song music dance uh and uh you know something revolving around their lives and okay. uh, a new york based filmmaker has written it and we we're, we're all doing um, our bit like in isolation we can take help from a friend or two okay. or just um uh you know like um 
uh, just one friend basically and um, uh, we're making this short and it's kind of a tribute to them uh, i don't want to say much but it's it's it'll be out soon so so that was like uh, a so lot so you're going to be dancing to a song yes um, om shanti om oh. <laughs> we we've, we've actually learned choreography for that okay, there's sing, a choreographer sing, on board can you sing two lines from it ah uh, I'm so such a bad oh, singer, man. <laughs> oh, um, Shanti, oh, what was the? Shanti, Shanti. जो छुप गया या वो पहली नजर से पहला. जो I learned it yesterday. जो छुप गया या वो पहली नजर से पहला सन. There's all that, that in the short. Is that one of the steps? Yeah. So, oh, oh. Shanti, oh. Shanti, 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 Om. All that jazz is there. Shanti, <laughs> Om. Shanti, Shanti, Om. Yeah. I don't know. Those yeah. are they used to do those steps. Ding, 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 ding. Yeah. Ding, yeah. Ding, 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 ding. The thing is, the thing is, there. It's it's a it's a proper like eight ten person sh- uh, crew, like cast and wow. crew, and the others can't dance. So they have actually given those steps. <laughs> it's very funny. But yeah. you can dance. I know you can dance. I I I I mean yeah I can I can I I there was a workshop for dance and stuff like on on online on Zoom. but yeah. luckily you know i was uh, i i kind of managed um, by watching and learning um, yeah. without being part of the workshop and don't you take dance classes dishe yeah that's my fun thing to do that's that a keeps fun me thing. that keeps me creative and makes me meet more people and uh, it's it's a weekend thing that i do out here I, i as i said i get bored very easily so weekends are like you know uh, it's like what do you do um so i kind of figured that's a good way of connecting with people and uh, you know staying in touch with dance my mom always says that you know you once you if you don't dance you're going to get rusty and stuff like that so yeah. you got to keep in touch even if you're doing it by yourself and stuff so yeah so tell us a little bit about your dance class which is dance? not on right now <laughs> no. oh yeah. well uh, there there are a lot of people out here who who like um who who um who love bollywood Yes. um and i've trained with um, all our amazing teachers shama tawar ashley lobo um sandeep soparkar uh, so yeah i just uh, i these are basically friends of friends so they yes. just want to they just want to do something fun in the weekend so we we all get together and dance <laughs> so like you pick songs and you teach them or yeah, you yeah yeah one song a month Yeah, one wow. song a month. Wow, Tisha, you're that, that too way, good. That, no, no, that way I also learn. You know, yeah. I learn. For me, it's it's like a free learning, uh, okay. different styles and stuff. And then you just enjoy with a bunch of people. So right now, are you doing like any Zoom classes of dance or anything for them? Ah, uh, no, no. I'm okay. doing Zoom classes basically for all the boring stuff: writers' meetings, actors' okay. meetings. Like my okay. my manager has been. setting it up so that we all are in touch we don't feel low uh, yes. especially people like me who are away from the family blah blah yeah. blah so yeah okay so that's what and i saw disconnected <laughs> uh, did you see episode 2 i i saw one and i saw the making of two i w- i will watch okay. it it just dropped right a couple of days back yesterday to, to, yeah yesterday yeah 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 so i have no, to day before i was filming this short i was filming this okay. short that's why okay. i kind of uh was yeah. tied up with that yeah so tomorrow we're shooting for um i know that's so amazing yeah <laughs> so you're basically connected to la look at you <laughs> yeah. i'm not working on that shot what the hell <laughs> that's not fair i mean you know i just i i do i just don't understand the way things work but it they work in the most amazing way i started cope with open at the same time i got disconnected and suddenly i'm like super busy busier than i've ever been for a long yeah. long time and i also heard so that the the filming part is like you know it's like it's it's a kind of it's a piece of work you know you you it takes your day and it's it, yeah. it keeps you on your toes and stuff it keeps us on our toes so the, the camera has just come about 2 hours ago they've sanitized it and now they've kept it oh. out and everything has to be wiped down and i'm not allowed to go near it because kumang and tasha do it all yeah and yeah, then yeah 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 wow 12 hours later they'll touch it and anyway they're doing the shot break up at the moment for our scene and things so yeah it's fun my it's fun my my, my friend wazi oh, wazi 
Wasim is asking me, "Do you miss India?" I do miss India, man. And we I, miss, fact, we I, miss him. <laughs> <laughs> no, I've been I've been contemplating uh, ever since like day one, since day one up until now. I've been like in in, in so much of double minds and doubts that. should i go back for a couple of months should i be here what's happening but i keep getting news from back home that you know you 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 would vouch for it that it's it's still you guys are in the phase where yes. we're still grappling with what's next yes. and stuff so don't uh, come right now yeah it's con- but yeah i was seeing i miss you and i miss all my friends and, and we miss my him. family thank you <laughs> yeah we really miss you okay so tell me about future projects anything anything on the line now <clears throat> for you well i'm writing a feature film i mean i i have been writing it for one year but um it's so uh pitching a film is like tough anywhere india la uh, so uh, my manager said we really really uh, want to make this film for you know and we know where you're coming from but we have to be like on the like bang on with the script you know so yes, that takes yes. time and uh, plus i'm not a writer writer so it's taking me some extra time uh, but i'm getting there so so yeah that hopefully if that happens uh, but the uh, like for now the industry is kind of on hold or yes you know it might just open late later in the year yeah. so that's about it yeah um doing a few shorts um and uh, it's it it was like i was i was waiting for um i was waiting for pilot season you know what's the pilot season yeah, here and yes, stuff and yeah. and as soon as it started it ended so yeah. that yeah. that kind of like you know um it kind of changed everything um and now we just everybody is just waiting for the industry to begin and stuff again okay. so yeah fingers crossed for uh, something nice i was i was on seal team on cbs like oh. year end Yes. um which is a huge show it's in its it fourth is. season i guess um yes. so i thought that that's a great start and i was just waiting yes. for the new season and i'm like oh that's not fair come on <laughs> okay so somebody watched you in ye hai aashiqui episode only yeah, for you yeah shrijana hi hi a lot of people are like i think everybody will just start abusing me because <laughs> we're not taking we're not talk, i'm not talking to them rather we'll but, talk to them we'll talk to them yes, in 5 soon. minutes we'll talk to them quickly i yes. want to ask you ha huh. what what is the favorite thing that you walked in we'll take questions in a minute ah favorite thing like what do you mean like uh favorite what's movie you worked in toughest or favorite most enjoyable oh, toughest is different favorite is different ha huh. <laughs> uh um, you have to be truthful to me yeah i'm i'm just thinking itna kuch kiya no okay my most favorite Achha, thing i shows and movies shows and movies everything haan, combined so my my favorite thing is hosting shows has, and movies ha uh, match point cricket match point that was a yeah, favorite nothing can, yeah 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 that's like look so I mean, happy <laughs> yeah 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 that i mean it was it kept me on my toes because my producers were like so strict Yeah. and they're like tishay you better get your shit right you know <laughs> no mediocre stuff so yeah. that kept me on my toes but the process chilling with people like brettley and kapil dev and like in the same room eating food with them talking with them talking life talking fun things that has been such a huge high and it yeah. it was for, it, i mean i did that for a year you know so i know uh, and it's for something which is like in my blood like you know cricket if not an actor i would i would have been a cricketer because i'm i was so good at that in my school da 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 um so that can't be replaced I, and i said it recently somewhere else also that that has been my most toughest and most fun Enjoy thing to do enjoyable so who all did you meet who all did you meet with match point ah oh, everybody yeah mostly ravi shastri um uh, kapil dev bretley dean jones um kef mohammad kef um uh, and uh, sharuk khan came to my uh, like you know uh, one of our shows um he was promoting movie lot of actors yeah tiger shroff wow. ritik this and that uh, so it was a good space to be in you know because it was um my <laughs> i'm not sounding i'm not trying to sound pompous but my my producer the day i got the contract he said 
you are getting the most envious job in the country <laughs> you know so you better do it well i was like yes. damn it why would you have to say that you know uh and then when i left when i was like leaving to come here he is like are you sure you want to leave this you know you oh. won't i mean you don't get this kind of a no, job every day and you're just yeah. going to grow you're just growing and you're like yeah. taking in exit leaving right leaving so so yeah that kind of hurt when i when i you know every film when you film film or tv when yeah. you like finish the project you know it, yeah. it it there's a void but this kind yeah. of left a hole in my heart <laughs> so yeah so that was and you um, went and you went to la where there was actually nothing waiting for you you had to yeah, restart and, from scratch that's very tough mm, yeah you're very special yatish it takes a Thank lot you. to be able to do that what does hope mean to you uh hope means positivity hope means um um you know having a having an outlook towards life which is uh which can maybe change it for the better um hope means um going moving in the right uh, right direction um you know with with enthusiasm um positivity uh yes. and it's also i think it's also connected to spirituality you know um so i i would i would say hope for me means positivity spirituality and um 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 focus in a nutshell spirituality positivity and focus that's lovely what is the toughest thing you remember about your work as an actor huh toughest thing one, would one be incident two... incident one um but uh, so in general i feel the toughest thing for any actor is you know that entire audition process because um i've seen some actors say it and me too you know i i'd rather be on set than audition because yes. auditioning is like you don't you have to please so many people you know so i think that's the toughest thing because yes. even like india you you don't have to please as many people but out here the process is like i was just one 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 casting director was just uh, telling us the process uh and it's it's layered you know you have to please yeah. at least 300 people after your audition 300 oh my god and more. i thought here was stuff Oh, no God. no here you have to please 300. 300 people at least on different levels wow. then you get cast for the uh, you know that part so that i think it's brutal there it there's it no is. comparison to anything in the world you know that when you go for like interviews and stuff like uh, for normal uh, like for jobs you have to please one two five ten people 300 no, people is please. that's the i think that's oh, the toughest part yeah it's very tough prepping and stuff okay. you can do it yes. yes so now let's please the people who are asking questions if you'd like you can go back to the top and answer them ah uh, ah uh, uh. okay firstly we got to say i i have to say hi to everybody savita then um, uh shrijana then amreen hey, tasha berry how are you <sighs> doing um yes uh amreen everybody um okay so someone i think someone asked uh uh, 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 uh yeah someone asked about uh, yeah aashiqui after after yes. share with you yeah aashiqui it's it's a bindas show and i yes. i've i've been blessed to do like three episodes and it's i think that uh, you know that that and other shows on mtv has such a good connect with the audience so that yes. has given me like uh, people still watch it and i just want to thank everybody who watches it uh, till date um, you know so okay molly hi um who is my favorite cricketer um it yes. has to be sachin sachin tendulkar um i mean i've grown up watching him in the 90s um yeah. so and you know that you had that connect with him Yeah, he yes. was your own he was family and stuff like that so sachin can't be replaced um Ever. he's he's yeah i mean i remember when i was i was um uh in one of the matches i think he came to the studio 
for one of the matches and i was just like in awe i was like i couldn't move uh, <laughs> you know it was so that it generally doesn't happen with everybody with sachin is like oh my god can i just go and say hi to him? <laughs> yeah yeah so sachin does that to you at least especially to a 90s kid you know who's uh, who's grown up in the 90s um savita says why don't you join bollywood yeah no, bollywood yeah yaar, man what to do <laughs> so they I, will take I you i can exit um no bollywood well you never know uh, anything I mean, is Indian possible film industry. yeah so we we all are trying let's see uh, if it happens um i we've i've done a movie man the perfect girl it's with uh, um Nandini Sen my daughter Max, auntie's daughter please watch it it's touching 5 million views guys that's awesome so please watch it and i'll put the it. link i'll put the link on your on your igtv video just now for the perfect girl yeah well it's I'll not very difficult to find yeah. if you type the perfect girl um so yeah that's that okay lovely any last minute advice or wisdom you want to give the audience for dealing with um, things Dealing with, things, yeah, dealing with things yeah dealing with life yeah 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 dealing with things in life you got to be you got to you got to be creative you got to have a positive outlook towards whatever um you know you're doing you i know their ups and downs are part of life but uh, you have to uh, my my motto is uh give it your best forget the rest you know you have to if you, you if if you really like something you have to give it your best you know and my second uh, motto in life is do not hesitate to try you know if you don't try you'll never know so you have to have to have to try and give it your best shot so these are the two things which fit in a sentence um and that's about it like and i and i want to give an example you know um yes when i uh, like about la when i was making the the decision whether i should come here or no i was just telling my mom that mom you know i don't after like after like 10 20 years uh when i when i'm old i don't want to go back and think that oh my god i didn't even try you know so yes. i must yeah. go to la and give it a shot who knows you know who knows what can happen and at least that would give me a better state of mind that hey at least i tried you know if yes, it didn't work absolutely. it didn't work but i tried uh, and i didn't um, back out of the game so yeah. so yeah that's my motto and that's my advice if that is uh, an advice i love it give it your best and forget the rest It's amazing. Yeah. That that's you, yeah. Pishi. I've seen you actually live like this. You don't just say it; you actually live like that. And thank you so much for agreeing to do this for me. Cope with no, hope. thank you, thank you. This was good. And hope to see I'm you looking... soon. Yes, see you soon, and all the best to you and Tasha for disconnected the entire. How many episodes is it? Eight, It's eight, eight. eight. Season one is eight. Okay, yeah. So all the best. May who knows? You might be here in LA soon to film an episode. You know, or be be part of something uh, moving ahead. Um, everything is going digital. So yeah, all the best to you guys. Thank you for inviting me thank to do you. this. And thank you, thank um, you, thank uh, you. Stay safe and stay healthy to you and all you guys. Okay, big hug to you, Tishy. Love you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Love you too. Bye bye. Bye. bye.